Is Instagram removing their square-based photos from the platform? Don't panic yet. This is based on a recent IGTV video announcement from the head of Instagram, Adam Masseri, where he said that Instagram is no longer a photo-based platform or a square-based platform. Now, in my last two videos, we covered the overall announcement with how this impacts you as an entrepreneur on the platform, where you need to pivot, what you need to be focused on, what you need to do, and whether or not photos will continue to be a part of the platform and why and for how long. So make sure you check out those two videos, very important for you. And in this video, I wanna talk about the square format comment. Now, a lot of people have come to me worried that they're no longer going to be able to post square format photos, which we know perform best on this platform and others. Don't panic over this. This is more so directed toward the video content on Instagram. We know that videos in the square format have performed better on Facebook and Instagram. Facebook owns Instagram in terms of ads and in terms of just people scrolling through the platform. So we know that there had been a very strong leaning towards square format videos for both Instagram and for Facebook. This is no longer going to be the case. With the rise of TikTok, we now focus on vertical based content. So things that are up and down and are aligned with your phone. So however you're holding your phone in your hand up and down is how we should be interacting and engaging with that video content. So you're going to start to see less and less square based video and more vertical based video in terms of Instagram and even Facebook as well. So you want to make sure that you are now filming vertically as opposed to horizontally. If you're going to be on YouTube, you want, of course, horizontal unless you're doing shorts, which is now vertical but we're seeing a dramatic shift toward that vertical based video content and not square based and not horizontal based unless it's YouTube. So you wanna make sure that you are aware that this comment is very likely specifically to video and not to photos. Right now they are continuing to allow photos on the app. They are gonna be allowing people to continue to post. Watch the last video for more information on that. But this isn't something you need to worry too much about in terms of photos. Now, maybe eventually they'll do away with photos, but we don't foresee that happening for a good long time, if ever, because they were built on photos. But we want to make sure that we are working with what works on the platform. So right now, video content is king. Make sure you check out those other videos to get more information on this. And if you need help with live streaming or with your reels creation, your video content creation, I got some courses for you and some free tutorials and all the things. So hit the subscribe and notification bell. We're going to continue our discussion on how you can be thriving on the social, play, the social media platforms despite the recent changes. And I want to answer your questions. So if you've got questions, drop them down below. I answer them live on air every Wednesday at 10 a.m. right here on the YouTube page and in our community tab and in our comments. So when you've got questions on Instagram, on Clubhouse, on TikTok, on YouTube, on Facebook, I'm here to answer them for you first and foremost. So drop your questions down below. I'll see you in the next video as we continue our discussion on how you can thrive on the social platforms despite these crazy changes and announcements that are being made right now.